Okay, very good. Oh, we forgot to clap uh, our hands. Clap your hands. Okay, practice. Let's have practice. My name is Margie Pena. I am the community developer here at Neighborhood Center. Yeah, yeah, you, like today. <laughs> I've been with the organization for 24 years. Every day it's a different day here in, in the lives of many people coming to our center. The letter H, which is, what is the common denominator? We have a wide array of services that bring people and transform their lives every single day. What you're needing to do is remember, we're, we're not just working on the math. We're I am an example of that transformation. You were at Hector. I'm Hector. We have a new initiative, the Prime Program. It's a program where we can provide an individual the resources, the training, so that they can become employable. We're going to connect them to core construction services or to the Maritime Logistics Program. Yes, I'm looking for the uh, Okay. The strength of this partnership is a collaborative partnership that we have with San Jacinto College, with Economic Alliance, and other partners. Go straight ahead, and it's on aisle four. I'm Dr. J.D. Tollop. I'm Director of Applied Tech and Trades uh, at San Jacinto College. This is a new program to neighborhood centers. Uh, we, we offer training for the contractors, uh, the construction trades uh, in the area. It's a program we've been working on for, for several years. Uh, now we've got some grants that are really able to back it up to the point of I have resource limitations, ma mainly rooms. So uh, when neighborhood centers and I started meeting, we immediately came up with, hey, this is a first step out of the box is you teach some classes uh, in my facility. And the grants are targeted for the socioeconomic group that they serve as well, so it, it's a perfect fit. I'm Margaret Kidd. I'm the project director of the TACT grant at San Jacinto College. We have a diverse course of offerings. We have embedded some certifications, for instance, warehousing operations, transportation operations, customer service, supply chain principles, inventory management, and procurement. And these are all jobs where we see a lot of demand in our local and regional economy. Well, I'm Mike Likes, Director of Neighborhood Initiatives for Neighborhood Centers. Was this the answer? Uh, with the needs of the community right now, after talking with industry and understanding their needs for uh, employees that uh, have the skills to, to help them uh, meet their goals, uh, neighborhood centers felt that positioned very well to be able to help uh, individuals in this community get the skills they needed to reach their, reach their full potential. Good morning. Hello. Hello. I realized we had uh, we had a common uh, uh, common goal that we were after. So it's a true collaboration, and it's uh, something we're just now kicking off, getting off the ground. But we'll be offering uh, classes uh, starting April 28th. Hi, I'm Tamara Nichols Smith, and I'm the Director of Communications for the Economic Alliance Houston Port Region. There are huge opportunities right now. We are in the midst of 35 to 40 billion dollars of capital expenditure build out right here in the Houston Ship Channel region. And those build outs are going to lead to 800 million dollars in tax revenues, and about 12.3 billion dollars will be spent on labor. During this build-out phase, we're looking for 112,000 construction workers to get the build-out complete, and then there'll be jobs in maintenance and operations, um, so on after that. We are hoping to launch this pilot program. We already, we've already done our interviews, we've already had info sessions and we've to identify individuals, and we are gonna be kicking this off in the next 30 days.